We're back with another Series 2 Hobby Box, and it's the only one of this product I have left, as you just can't find blasters at your local Targets, all the Walmarts, just all sold out. It's, it's hockey, and that's absolutely nuts to me. Um, but, you know, what can I say that you haven't already heard? There's lots to unpack here as we take another look into the 2023-2024 Upper Deck Series 2 Hobby Box, which is now retailing for $330 plus tax. The price has absolutely been bedarded. Um, last time, we were lucky enough to pull a population count 1,000 of the man himself, Connor Bedard. But obviously, what we're searching for is this kid's young gun and maybe even hit a jackpot of that one of one million dollar Connor Bedard outburst. Now, imagine if I was one of those channels that promises to rip it in half and I got it. I am not. I would absolutely not. But if you hear me falling down, that would be me having a heart attack and I'll have died because... This country's healthcare system, even with a million dollars, I'd still be in debt. Anyway, before we get into that, I do want to highlight the upcoming hockey break that I do have, which all center around this 1516 Upper Deck Series 2 Hobby Box, also Series 2, uh, where I'll be searching for Jack Eichel's Young Gun, along with Connor McDavid's OPG Glossy Rookie, Rookie Update, UD Portraits Rookie, Rookie Materials, Rookie Breakouts, Clear Cut Superstars, which, yeah, right. Uh, Young Gun's Astate, again, yeah, right. Program of Excellence, I wish. But, you know, what I'm really hoping for is the fabled Connor McDavid canvas young gun. That looks really nice and I really love it. Anyway, so be sure to like and subscribe. I'm only asking for 500 subs for this break to happen. And I've been fluctuating between 480 and 510 for the last few weeks. I would really love to be able to push this to a steady 500. So just ask your baby, your mom, your sister, your brother, your son's football coach. Um, well, football coach. I mean, if he has a football couch that has a YouTube, you know, subscription, go for it, whatever. Um, yeah, just go for it. Uh, hell, you know, if you know Connor Bedard or Connor McDavid, um, ask them to subscribe. I'd really appreciate that, uh, and it helps the channel grow. Anyway, moving into this, I'm gonna put this away. Every pack of this guy, and uh, by the way, we can take a look at the box real quickly. Um, the Heat seal here. Well, I shouldn't say heat seal. The, the heat strength wrap. Not quite there. So maybe that's a good sign. They're too busy putting expensive card in here. Um, to be able to seal it. Because they were worried about damaging it, right? Of course. Um, anyway, again. Uh, oh, when there are three inserts per pack, uh, they're sandwiched in the middle like a valuable burger of money. And the box will have... Tons of parallels, really looking forward to getting more PC cards because they're really cool and just neat looking. Young Guns, obviously, we want outbursts, we want clear cuts, uh, deluxe exclusives, outburst red, high gloss, and of course the outburst, go uh, outburst gold, which is uh, big money. <laughs> uh, key rookies include Benson, Lafriere, um, Man, Carlson, of course, Mitten, um, Cartier, po Poitras, just tons of good ones. But obviously, all overshadowed by Bedard. Um, in any other year, those would have been the big hits. But this one, it's basically, uh, especially for the price, it's going to be Bedard or Bus. Um, what other Bedard cards are in here? We got Dazzler's OPG Glossy Population Count, uh, Program of Excellence, uh, UD Portraits, uh, and again, just like last time, no jerseys, no autographs. Sorry, your boys. First pack. Oh, actually, well, we've opened the first pack, but what we're going to do is have Connor Bedard bully his cards out of the pack. We're going to say it's... Let's go for this guy. Pack Wars. These two guys. These two guys. We got Connor Murphy. Brady Shea, Bennington, Olafson. We've got a Director of Boards. Zach McEwen bullying a uh, Maple Leaf. Got a for the Young Guns. Get that off to the side. Maxence Cunet. Don't know much about him. But we have his card. First young gun of the box. And we've got Evander Kane letting a young fan have a puck. <laughs> Bad handwriting, but all right. It's fine. 
Even people with bad handwriting are allowed to have pucks. Uh, Kairu, Pionk, Bjorkstrand, Gurianov, and Pasternak. Oop. Thought that had some cards in it. Suspiciously liked. Stuart Skinner, Henrik, New Hook, Schneider. You got Monster Season, which means we're not going to get a, get a glaring, unfortunately, of Connor McDavid. And let's see what what he got. McDavid opened the scoring for Edmonton with his 42nd goal the season in his first period on the road versus the Sen Ottawa Senators. Superstar also added two assists in the 6-3 win. Cool. This was a better Monster Season card than the one we got previously, so that's cool. Just going to put, I think I damaged that card already. We got Ecliptic, Kirill Kaprizov. Very cool. And Tyler Clevin on a roll. Superstar of the Ottawa Senators. Truba, Coyle, Blackwell, Novak, and Gensel. So we're expecting to get six Young Guns, four UD Canvas cards, and at least one outburst of either a veteran or a Young Gun. And we have our first outburst. I, it is not a Young Gun, so I'm just going to go straight to it. McDonough, Deneau, Gerard, Bergeron, and we got Instinctive, Vamelka. I thought this was damage, but it's actually just a puck. So, it's cool. It's whatever. Distinctive. We have a Zach Benson on the Youngins, which is pretty good. Very good rookie. Hope he has a great year. And continues to have many great years ahead because, uh, well, I'm invested. I have his rookie card. Alrighty. And our Outburst, which always amazing cards. Love the way it looks. Wade Allison. Don't care for the team. McCabe, Shea Theodore, Tuck, and Lister Annan. Got Batherson, Raymond. Hartman, Sergeyev, Lindell, and Instinctive, Mad Sogard. We're burning through the Young Guns. One in every pack so far, but I know that's not going to last. Matt Tompkins of uh, the Lightning. Very cool. And we've got Program of Excellence. That's really cool. Wade Redden. That is really cool. Did not get a program of excellence in a while. I think the last one I got was of uh, Max Domi. Very cool. Gibson, Sorokin, Malkin, and Carlson. That might be our program of excellence. Might be our box hit. Kachetkov, Gallagher, Eriksson Ek, Lawrence. We got UD portraits of. Re oh, wow, okay. A red UD portraits. Is this numbered? Trevor Zegris. Out of 25. Wow. Really cool. Never seen a red one before. Kyle Connor, PCs. Another young gun. Looks like we're not getting our Bedard. Ilya Solkov. No guns. It's okay. It's okay. Neilander, Arvidsson, Stone, Roslovic, and Sprung. It's okay. We've we've gotten a population count Bedard. It's okay. Drysdale, Millstat, Chandler Stevenson, 
Hoffman, and we've got a Tage Thompson Sparkle Ecliptic. Do like the sparkles, look very, very cool. Got our canvas behind him. Joss Morrissey on the UD canvas. Canvas cards there. Oh, right, yeah, the Program of Excellence was a canvas card, too. Don't know if I mentioned it, but just realized. But I'm still keeping it separate from my other canvas cards. And then we got Bolduc on a roll. Hayden Fogel, Vamelka. Checklist with Carlson Makar and Mikhaev. Ooh, almost dropped it. Huso, Jack Eichel, Kent Johnson, Need Rider, Jake Sanderson, and PCs of Alex Ovechkin. Very cool. Young guns are slowing down, but I do not think we'll be getting a Bedard in here. We've got Deep Roots. Morgan Riley. And on a roll, Askarov. Riley again. <laughs> Silverberg, Uyghur, and Marsleekins. We're down to our last five very expensive packs. Getting more and more expensive as every day passes. We've got Stutzel, Ozaka, Fluffernair, Heischer, White Johnson, and Tage Thompson on the Sparkle. PCs. Cool. Morgan Frost on the UD Canvas. Unroll. Kellman. Lawson Krauss, Kakonen, Zub, and Falk. Kuzmenko, Vetchkit, Anderson, Brock Nelson. We got PCs of Jason Robertson. Very cool. Deep Root Sebastian Ajo. We got another young gun. Pretty good one, actually. Sebastian Ajo. Deep roots. Fraser Minton basically guarantees that we are not getting a Bedard Young Gun in here. Um, we've already got two pretty pretty good players. Minton and Benson. So. Put these across, actually. Fabro, Doughty, Paterka, and O'Connor. Will, will the final young gun show up in the pack wars? I don't know. Hegel, Faraby, Yamamoto, Manson, and <laughs> Ryan Reeves, director of boards. Just absolutely bullying a Dallas star. Oh, wow. Holy moly. A black UD Canvas program of excellence, Simon Gagne. Oh, wow. That is a really cool card. Two program of excellences? What a box. It's crazy. Yeah, uh, uh, an alumni. Yeah, I didn't think there was a new player with Gagne's name, but uh, that's really, really cool. Wow. With an honor roll, Evangelista. Mangiapane, Sanheim, Shesterkin, Andrew Kopp, and Sorelli. This is not numbered, is it? I don't think so. Yeah, not numbered. Anyway, we're down to Pack Wars, left or right. It's either Pop Count or Opichi. See who won. Let's see which, which Connor Bedard won. Romanoff, Marshman, Faraby, Pereko, Burakowski, and we've got Ecliptic. Bo Horvat. 
followed by Deep Roots Cam Fowler. Followed by UD Portraits, Brady Kachuk, not numbered. Tippett, Mantha, Brat, and JT Miller. Final pack of the box. Final chance. My card. Low, low possibility here. Baron, Bailey, Ferraro, Spencer Knight, Mitch Marner, and we've got a Dazzlers of Stuart Skinner. We've got an instinctive Stuart Skinner. And if we've looked at the pack, <laughs> Ryan Shea, Young Guns. Followed by M Martin Nuke, Meyer, Sam Steele, and Person. Well, there you have it. Um, I think. Oh, and yeah, these were. These were the cards in there. I guess relatively even with the pack wars, whatever. I'm going to call it a dead heat. None of these cards stand out to me. But what cards do stand out? Simon Gage, black and white program of excellence, UD Canvas. Wade Redden, <laughs> UD Canvas program of excellence. And this awesome red. Out of 25, Trevor Zegers. You do portraits. Oh, well, we can't forget Minton and ben Benson. Pretty good box. A pretty outstanding box considering there's no Bedard in here. Uh, so what did you think of the break? Did it meet your expectations? Did you get better cards than I did? Leave a comment and let me know. Thanks for watching and, uh, well, good luck on your next break.